So this is how the machine looks when it has not been cleaned properly. The handle is extremely sticky. The whole hood is sticky everywhere. You can see yellow spots here. Uh, the window is sticky both outside and inside. Looking underneath the machine, it's, it's extremely sticky. And this, this stickiness comes from, from the coolant and lubricant, which uh, gets sticky if you don't clean it away immediately. Even the control panel is, is full of this uh, stickiness. So this is how it should not look when you have cut in this machine. One of the things that I can see uh, that it's wrong is that the hood is closed. It should be left open when, when you're finished. So if I open up here, we can see also on the inside that it's very sticky, that residuals from cutting uh, is all over the machine inside here. And we have this thing for cleaning. It's very, very easy to clean this machine and still it has not been done. So it's important. So the consequences if you don't clean is that I have to clean. And enough, if I have to clean, I can't help you with your samples. So you better clean or you will not be allowed to come into the room. So now finally I remove this sticky layer from the handle. It's very nice to touch when it's clean, not nice to touch when it's sticky. So I would say now it, it looks as it should look when you're finished with your cutting. Uh, and if you have a mess on the floor, you can use this bucket together with this one. It works. And finally, <coughs> when you get scrap from cutting, metal scrap, you put it here. Paper, you put there.